Hi, and welcome to another installment of Math Basics, Mr. Besh. We're solving an equation here. Uh, it's combining like terms. It's a little bit more challenging than the last one, um, but uh, it's done basically the same way. One of the things that causes students grief when they look at this equation right off the bat is the fact that you got two terms with x here and you got two terms not. Now, it, normally students see a, a one-step equation, a two-step equation, they think it's easy. But if the equation doesn't look like that form, they tend to uh, get a little bit apprehensive. Now, the goal is to get into your comfort zone, and that means to take your equation and do what you can to make it into that two-step equation. And this is how you go about to do it. The first thing I need to do is take the two terms that have the variable, the x terms, 7x, and note this is negative 5x. Remember, the symbol in front of the term dictates whether it's positive or negative. You are going to combine these terms together. A positive 7 and a negative 5 combine together to make positive 2x's. What's happening is you're taking 2, eventually they're making 1. You're doing the same thing with the numbers here. This is a negative 2, and this one here is a positive 8. Well, a negative 2 and a positive 8 combine together to make plus 6. Remember your rules for integers and what happens when you combine your terms together. And now take a look. Again, we have our two-step equation here, and from here it should be a piece of cake. You simply do the opposite of plus 6 to both sides, which is minus 6. And then you get 2x is equal to 24. The opposite of multiplying by 2 is dividing by 2. And you get your x value, which comes out to be 1. That's it. I hope you found this both helpful and informative.